Welcome to Epic Fantasy Gaming. I'm Joe, here with me is my co-host, Dan. Hello and greetings. And now it is time for... So we go to... The Final Bottles! Yeah. There's no... If Chu says it's true, there's no mistake. <laughs> <laughs> like yeah. that went well so far in the war. Yeah. Whenever Shu has said, oh yeah, we can... Uh, it's like, this is gonna... We're, this is gonna be good. It's all this, good. this aspect of him saying, don't... Don't use torches. Let our eyes get accustomed to the darkness and leave the torches at the base. It's actually really smart. Mm-hmm. How unusual. Look, the torches in Dunar and Castle are burning. They're probably in there trying to figure out how to run away. I have a report! The advanced forces under attack are under attack by the Dunan army. Gah, Lord Luca, the Dunan army has a beard behind us. Gah. See, Luca should have counted on this sort of this kind of thing, because you know if something can go wrong, it often does. I actually think this is proof of Luca kind of not thinking things through as much. He got scared and impulsive. I think it's because Toron joining in. It's their border guard, but he got so scared at the thought of Toron, he just said, okay, you know what? We're just going for this night raid. I can't afford to delay anymore. That's why he's going, we have to attack right at their heart. He's like, I want to end this war because Toron's involved. They have a professional new model army styled army and they have all but gunpowder with them. I don't want to fight that. I want to end this war, negotiate a, tr a treaty with them and just, or, and you know, like and prep for the next war. And if need to, hand Sazagay over to them. Yeah. That would have been smart, actually. They'd chop off his head and take his rune, but that'd be well worth it. Because Luca's an incredibly timid general. You! How did you know about the night raid? Oh. Oh, yeah, it's you first. If I was Flick, it second. Luca Blight, I want your head! head. I want your head. Foolish braggart. You think a weakling like you can stand up against me? As you can see, Dan's glorious team. I say Thor shot. Oh, explosion is going to be good. Uh, maybe save his. Save his reserve. Not protectness. Oh, yeah, protectness. Actually, that does work. Never mind. My bad. Sorry about that. I shouldn't even be giving advice. It's your team. I'm going to be as much a spectator for this video as guys are. So, I might occasionally Oh wow, these guys hit hard. Three that center unit. Holy Toledo. One. Oh, they did a combo attack. I didn't expect that. I actually love this music. Suspicion. Oh, he's running again. Oh, he's doing the damage. Well, oh, he gets three attacks. Gets another shot. Hmm, not bad. Yep. Now, we're gonna need kindness rain, but boldly. I suspected there might be a need. Wait, hold on. Maybe not kindness right now. I'm just looking at that. I didn't hit that many people, actually. If you want, you can use kindness right now, but like. It's either that or healing items. Because Kinnison and Humphrey need healing in particular.
Yeah, we got a lot of water rooms on everyone. Flip broke the game. <laughs> that didn't work out for him. We have to hope uh, Hicks survives this. We're not doing too great. How about we do better? Oh, that's awesome! We beat him. Wow. It's my, the first time I truly beat him with Fleck. Really? Yeah. Mm. Now, we're going to stop there and divide this into three videos. Mm. One for each battle. So, if you enjoyed it, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Tell us what you think of this team. Yeah, I think we did great with it.